All right, Miss Porter, you're up. Welcome. Thank you. Hi. My best friend's daughter has cerebral palsy. That's what? Has cerebral palsy. I've witnessed firsthand the level of care required to keep her strong. I heard teachers begging for funding to provide care for the future generation of children. I've gone door knocking and spoke to a family who's told me mental health facilities turn their difficult son away. They're worried they'll die and their son end up in prison because that's the only kind of facility left for him. This state has real problems that need to be focused on. I hear the terms gun sense and common sense, but I never see any of these groups or their supporters that are against guns actually show any common sense or gun sense on the subject. Isn't it common sense to teach children gun safety? 150 million guns won't go away, and a gun ban won't make guns disappear. No matter how many guns get confiscated or burned up, people will find a way to make weapons. Isn't that common sense? Let's teach the new generations real gun sense, safety, training, responsibility, accountability, the importance and the history. Guns should be ingrained into society better than this. We are a nation suffering from mental health issues, drug issues, and depression. The epidemic isn't the gun. It's the lack of education, understanding, and true common sense. Virginia is home to lots of military and police who put their lives on the line to serve and protect. These are people with families of their own and put their lives on the line to protect ours. These same people will be labeled felons with the governor's proposed bills. He's requesting our tax dollars to label us felons. <coughs> Isn't it common sense to see he's trying to rob us and call us criminals? I wasn't born in America. Isn't it common sense to look around the world and see the pattern of gun confiscation as giving the government too much power? I'm asked by my family all the time if I want to go back to Brazil. I choose to be an American. I choose to live in this country where the Constitution is the law. I didn't realize people like the governor or these groups like Moms Demand, Every Town, and their supporters could break the law but label me the felon. Please protect our rights, oppose gun control, and spend our tax dollars on issues that will actually positively impact the lives of Virginians. Thank you very much.